Hey everybody, it's Tomorrow CS 19 here, and I'm back here with uh, the first one. This is my first rant. So we're going to be starting the first rant on Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrate. So anyways, we're going to be starting with the rant. Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrate for Nintendo Switch. Now, more like Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom Dehydrated on the on the crap Tendo Switch. Oh my god, this version sucks. So the reason why this ver- Well, my girlfriend bought this game for the Nintendo Switch. He I mean, come on! Why did he buy that version? People wonder, you know, why did some people buy? Why did a few people buy the Switch version? Well, a few percentage of the people bought this game on Switch because they want to take it on the go, or they only own a Switch. But they're gonna have to deal with the main issues this game has. As you can see, turn it on. As you can see, the main issues of the game are, firstly, is graphics. The graphics are, uh, they're horrible. They're very horrible. And, I mean, come on, look, this animation here is running at 60 FPS. But when you're going outside, look what happens. When you're going outside, look, look at the frame rate. I mean, come on, look at everything. It runs very horrible on Switch. It is very laggy. And look at the frame rate. This game has much choppier frame rate. It runs at 30 FPS mostly. See how the heat. See, look at the frame rate. Look, see, choppier. The frame rate is very choppy. And look, the shadows are very worse. And there's pixelated edges on all the models. And that's it. So, what I'm telling you guys. What I'm suggesting you is stay away from the Nintendo Switch version of SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrate. Buy this game on PS4 and Xbox One, and as well as PC. Buy it because those versions are much better than the Switch version. But even though the Switch version is very laggy, it has a lot of glitches. A lot, I'm telling you. The PS, the Xbox One version, eh, it has some glitches. The, the PS4, a few, PS4 and PC, a few glitches. Now the version that a lot of people are buying is... Is... PS4. The reason why a lot of people are buying this game on PS4 is because, well... It's all because of the game's... It's all because of the original game. <clears throat> Because, uh, you know, guys, because let me tell you about the original game. Back then, when the original game came out, let me tell you what version did a lot of people buy. When the original game came out, a lot of people bought the PS2 version. That's the version that sold more, PS2, because, I mean, come on, the PS2 was, I mean, the PS2 version looked horrible, but even though it sold more copies, the however, the GameCube version sucked because... I don't know. Well, it had much better use of graphics than the PS2 did. For the Xbox, well, the original Xbox version was, uh, well, it had better graphics, so, but even though it sold secondly than the GameCube. And PC, well, Rehydrated's PC version was different than the original game because the original game was full of mini games. And lastly, the PC version of Rehydrated was much better than the other version. Firstly, mods. I mean, come on, there are mods. Toasted Shoes, full-time funny guy on YouTube. Here's what Toasted Shoes does. Does hilarious mods on the game. He does hilarious mods on Battle for Bikini Bomb Rehydrated. Hilariously mods on, like, you know, the which one, like... His recent release on Battle for Bikini Bomb Rehydrated, Ruined by Mods 2, which, you know... This one is where he turns Sandy into Dora the Explorer. And, uh, yep. So. And besides, the Switch version should have been cancelled. Because, firstly, because of the Switch selling very poorly. Now, does anyone even know who likes this game? Well, my adult friend likes the Switch version, but I respect his opinion on it. Now, do you all guys know who hates this game? This version? All Spongebob fans, they hate it because this version was very laggy. But let me tell you about this, guys.
Screw SpongeBob Battle Free Kitty Bomb Rehydrate on Switch. And screw Crash and Spyro games being released on the Nintendo Switch. No, but if you like these versions, I still respect your opinion. Anyways, the Crash and Spyro games on PS4 are 100, 999 billion times better. Are 999 trillion times better than the Spongebob Battle Bikini Bomb Rehydrate on Switch and their Switch counterparts. End of rant.